Art Institute, um, who's actually from New Zealand. He's from Aotearoa, so this is for you, buddy. Okay, it's called He Tangata. He Tangata is a phrase I kept hearing when I was over there last year, and I heard it in the songs, I heard it in conversation, I heard it in the speeches, and it means life is people. The highs are higher here, the moon more silver. Time takes on shape, ripe fruit, ready in the orchard, crossing over, dying a shaman's death to exist amongst men with slapped red chests, black-lipped sisters, hymnal rhythms thick as brick walls, impacts just as strong. Decorative weapons, warriors of the mind, kind kin begin again after fallen heritages and natural disasters, delivering messages to move on, fear not, move on. These beautiful people of bright song, these brown relations, these strong people of swelling pride and brave wave travelers with teams of fierce intentions stood before women, unwounded, unwavering protection. These tribal people of wood and reeds, feathers and ink, mysteries in genealogy, the wind, the wind, the wind. Listen blood wars, love chants, walking original canvas, storytellers and prophets grow and thrive in this era of interesting time, in this area of airborne light, in this place of magic honey medicine from the vigilant bumblebee. I love it. Together we stand under one sun and cast new shadows over welcoming grasses. I want to trace the silhouettes and dress the naked space with words of appreciation. But there are no words I know in any language, written or spoken, to express the depths of emotion of this movement of our memories that our time together can describe. Regretfully, I have nothing. Nothing but these inadequate words as a way to say, Hey, Tangata, life is people. Because we all come from somewhere, and we travel from one end of the earth to the other looking for something. Measure time and distance and count the miles between us until we reunite. Take flight. Keep flying. Find your personal thermals. Circle the summits. Spin golden threads. Memory webs around the globe. We are never alone. Hey, Tangata. Hey, Tangata. Hey, Tangata. Life is people. Thank you. Hey, El Pablo Blanca, thank you for <laughs> He's been our go-to guy in uh, making this all come together, so much thanks. We say in the Coast Salish territory, we say, Hachuka, Hachuka, Siam. Thank you. Uh, ha -ha, distractions. The stars are distracting me with their beauty, keeping me from duty and purpose. Your voice is distracting me, telling me to move on, don't linger too long where visions are born. Cities get torn between progress and politics. Nations balance, they straddle two worlds, choose sides out of doubt or compliance as we exercise caution and our need to proceed along new paths. Where we feel our way into dark tomorrows, moving with ancient faith, we create deep tracks left for anthropologists to make fiction of our past. Where are you now? Where are we now? Even on the outside, we still hold a place, embrace liberation inside, living on the outside of normal ground zero, where concepts of the minority are actually the majority. And all of us who don't fit in begin to win votes. Undo what we know not to be true, live by our own codes, love those we want, and only those who love us back. Mm. We celebrate this fringe of forced displacement. Our uniqueness brought us here, where we dance to our own drums, speak in our own tongues, live by our own laws, because we have found each other in the fringe. Thank you. Mm -hmm.
that was a poem about um, people who don't fit, feel like they don't fit in, and I think that's goddamn everybody. So we, you know, we all don't fit in. It's so funny. That's ironic, right? Um, hey, look at she's taking the mic out, and she's kicking her shoes off. Okay, I'm just saying. Uh, <laughs> this poem is called um, "Just Try," and it's a political poem, and uh, it has to do with. Um, what, the silly border, right? It's just so silly. Border, what border? I don't see no border. It's called Just Try. <clears throat> it was like a fall day in Maine. Crisp and crystal clear. Liquid light pouring into me monumental mental messages of understanding. It was like Leonard Cohen saying, pass me a pen. I want to write something down. It was that profound, the understanding. I am Ongwohoi. Yes, we say no to the border, dotted lines separating, pushing us up and over distance and time. I am Ongwohoi. No more an angry Indian. I am content in my disgust. I like that you don't trust me and think that I have everything. It makes me try harder not to barter my way through. So to begin, I'll win this Mohawk, uh, sorry, talent of, uh, sorry, I'll win this North American idol of poetry, following acts of civil disobedience, cleaning up the mess. No more talks. This is my roadblock. These are my lines. This is my line. Cross it. Just try. Come over to my side. Just try. Befriend me, be an ally. Look through my glasses, walk in my shoes, eat at my table one day, just one day, just try. You can see who I am on the status card that took six years to get and the passport I have to renew yet, and still the questions come. Where are you from? What is your citizenship? <laughs> I'll tell you my citizenship when you tell me the name of the ship your people came over on. <laughs> I think this, and they let me go on. I am Ongwahoi. Not to be confused with Canadian, the beverage. I haven't drank in 21 years, so tell that to the beer company pimping out his country in the name of sales. Wait a minute, I'm not quite done. This is all in fun, so if I've offended you, relax. This is not an attack on you. I'm just spilling my truth, living proof that a Mohawk goddess, warrior poet, still screams like Pauline. Homegirl, pioneer, hip hop scratching a rhythmic trail from Missouri to Alaska, from Victoria to Boston and beyond. She made this land her literary playground, and I intend to do the same without blame or pointing fingers or instilling guilt. That's not what my power is built on. So, my name may get bigger, and I'd still be the nigger of this land. Now do you understand how it works? I am home. I am home south of the border and south of that border. Everywhere is home. Every place is sacred indigenous land. The minute you think you own it, that's when you've blown it. People as old as the trees can be found standing our ground. We are a package deal. I am the Ongohoa messenger and will gladly pay the price to bring these words to you because you can't sue someone who has nothing to lose. Go ahead, just try. Thank you. I like starting a sentence like that. Heck. Um, last year I was here in May, and uh, in, a, in a quick flash of a two-week period, Alex and I, um, we took over every reading series there was, and, uh, and we produced a CD at the same time, and that CD is called Got Your Back, and uh, it's a um, combination of studio uh, recordings and live poetry recordings. And you know, it, we had so much material uh, you know, in that two week time that we thought, oh, well maybe we'll put out a, a two CD set and we thought their people are gonna think, who those poets think they are putting out two CD sets. So we just kept it to one CD. We didn't wanna you know, be bold like that. But um, 
Anyways, this one is uh, one that didn't make it on because it's a, it's a new piece. It's called Opposite Directions. I have actually an EP out there. It's called Six Directions, and so this is part of the, that EP, Opposite Directions. <clears throat> Why talk about territory? Why vote or go to war? I make no threats. I take it outside. Let's go. Culture claims and difference inside language talks with rented words from the future. I cannot deny the energy matter person I am, the people that come from, the way we live. Time and land are unrelated. What do you hear inside my sound combinations? Flat notes, float sync, meaningless vocables, chants, take a chance. Treaties keep treating. History's repeating. Singers keep singing. I am constantly singing. Hey! Awakeness is not the same as awareness. I could care less when asked how you fit in. Through impatience, I embrace accelerated methods of communications. Test me, text me about imbalanced sustainability. There is not enough land to grow all the food to feed all the people. Some of us have got to go delete. At least stop feeding people into the problem. Intelligence is a trickster, looking like a prince with solutions, but given time is revealed to be a northern beggar, mixed race, rudderless brother, cultureless court jester. The drums are sounding, the women are coming, and we're not asking, we're telling. Our place is on the land, in front, on our feet, leading, let's go. So I'm told, the black ones hold the gift of music, the yellow ones know how to heal. The red ones have been caretakers of this land forever and ever. And the white ones keep talking. Time and land face opposite directions, looking backwards towards the west where everything is sung into being. Keep breathing, keep singing the melodies that made you. I am bringing waves of my land to your liquid threshold. Hold on, let's go. Happiness is a song sung on the land by those who know it. Thank you. Hey, Jim. I'm glad you stuck around, man. <laughs> <laughs> um. I'm glad Jim stuck around because he opened uh, the set, the art of reading tonight with um, a piece about Jimi Hendrix. And, it, and I love it when people are on the same like collective wavelength because I chose to read a, a poem about Jimi Hendrix tonight too. It's called Third Stone from the Sun. So there you go. Um, Jimmy says, open your mouth, swallow this. Are you experienced? It's getting late so much earlier, the sun sets inside the earth, glowing with rhythm, resounding sunshine, blowing my mind to bits. He who throws the first stone takes down the gate, passes through without answers. We never earn the right to know, but take it just the same. We are experienced. Jimmy says, Prama Mua, Nutjak Tik Fu, speaking in tongue, silver fork vocables, not quite poetry, but poetry just the same. We create a place where words have no dominion, where sound makes shapes, pictures plastered on landscapes, teachings and politics from sun beings beyond. Man, are we peeking? This terrific poison bringing us closer into focus. I think I'm in love. I think I am love. I am love. I love love. Whoa, it wasn't long before we unlocked the rocks, released them from sleep and inertia, disturbances so natural and necessary. We climbed down the cosmic ladder opposite of Never Never Land, throwing the second stone for luck into fountains. Jimmy says, make a wish. And I tell him the same thing I say when the stars fly by, make us aware. Because once you're aware, you can't become unaware. Whoa. 
Together we grasp a staff extending as far above as below, make a connection to something like lightning, hateful hostilities released, compassions compelling our souls. The third stone waits, patient and pretty. We boomerang round the sun, meet our future at the beginning, the same one lived yesterday, broken stones know nothing. Whoa. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. That's it for me. I think we might have another um, open mic, yeah? One more. One more. Okay. Maybe. 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 Okay. So thank you again, Janet. It's a wonderful evening with um, four really wonderful.